Coyote knows what accessories to add to get your creative juices flowing. In front of me, I've got the beautiful 36-inch gas grill. This is the S-Series, and standard with the S-Series is a rotisserie. Now, there's a few simple steps and quick tips to get it ready to use for this. And the first is to remove the warming rack. Take and set that aside. And then probably the most intuitive thing that Coyote did is they put a storage for the rotisserie on the back of the grill. This is something that would otherwise, you know, it's a little dangerous, it's a little cumbersome. I mean, what drawer do you have that that'll fit in? Coyote's got the solution. They put it on the backside where it's safe, out of the way, and where it's easy to access at any time. Gently connect the rotisserie spit by inserting it inside the motor. The motor is really convenient to put on and take off. If you're not using a rotisserie, it can be just removed and stowed, put in a drawer. There's a few things you need to know about the rotisserie. First of all, its maximum capacity is 20 pounds, so that's a lot of chicken. It's a good capacity, and when you're using it, you'll never use any of the lower burners. You're just going to use the back infrared burner. Now, some of the benefits of rotisserie are obvious. There is a constant basting. You're getting radiant heat that directs right at the food product, basting and basting. One thing you will have to do is put a pan, a sheet pan, just underneath. And what this will do is it will catch any fat or any liquid and prevent it from falling down and really making a mess of your lower grill area. Just make sure when using the rotisserie to close the hood as often as possible, you're gonna get that heat rolling on the inside. You wanna make sure that you keep it closed so that you contain all of that heat. For this accessory and many more, make sure to go over to coyoteoutdoor.com. <laughs>